Hi, this is Brian D. Hill from USWGO.com. I have some very terrible news to report. It used to be right up here, I had on the bar it said that I can upload videos more than 15 minutes, which is why I was able to upload my entire documentary. Uh, America from the Road of Freedom to the Streets of Fascism, even though that was considered a copyright infringement, even though all the excerpts I was using was clearly uh, protected under fair use. Fair use exemptions under copyright law, which gives me the right to educate people in my documentary. Now, they've taken away my 15 minutes. I mean, my, you know, that where I can upload videos longer than 15 minutes. Yes, it now says 15 minutes. 15 minutes, and then it says increased limit not available for this account. And guess why I'm punished? They claim that, look, look, look at this. Uh, the not in good standing content ID claims. I have never got a strike on my account for copyright infringement. I've never, I was never in trouble for any community guidelines. But I got in trouble because of what's on their cloud systems. Because their cloud systems identified a lot of videos I was using that's protected under fair use, that's clearly protected under fair use, and uh, they clearly said, oh, this is violating the content ID system. One of them is uh, Alex Jones's uh, America Destroyed by Design. I tried to dispute it and it said reject it. Claim has been reinstated. So that's one of the reasons they have limited my account. Of course they didn't before, but now they're cracking down people even though I, I didn't do anything more than what's over here. And then of course they tried to shut down 30 seconds, 30 seconds, 30 second video. They tried to have that blocked in America and then and then and then there was another one investigation shows of uh, Hitler Bush blah 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 and then uh, help us now America and then of course I was just trying to make a parallel between Star Wars what's happening in Star Wars and what's happening in America it's blocked worldwide and that's another reason they claim I'm not in good standing so now they're claiming I have to go to court for each of these videos I have to go to court I have to go in front of a judge or jury for each of these videos under content ID or else I am limited to 15 minutes I may have my account shut down I may have my account shut down USWGO may be shut down forever, and there is no way I can save this. And that means the end of America, from the road of freedom to the streets of fascism. That means the end of my documentary that I did myself. You know, some of the footage in there was my own footage, even though I do use some footage as copyright, and they keep adding more and more content ID claims against my account by saying, oh, this thing with John F. Kennedy is a content ID. I mean, they just keep adding more and more. And then, of course, I try to argue it's under fair use, and they reject it, saying, No, Brian, you're not under fair use. You're not under fair use. Go to court, Brian. Go to court. Go to court, Brian. Get a lawyer. Go to court. That's literally what they're <laughs> telling me. <laughs> and then to make matters worse, not only are they limiting me to 15 minutes, this has never happened before. I was able to upload more than 15 minutes before, so... This is dangerous. I mean, we're heading right for, I mean, now that everything's going on to cloud systems, I literally have to go to court. I have to go to court for every video to get that off of the Content ID Matches system. And they can put it back on there, even after I go to court. I mean, this, I mean, there, there's, not, there's not even a law. Uh, for the whole content ID system. There's not even a law in force with this. They're just, this is a private contractual system. So even if I go to court and pay thousands of dollars for a lawyer, that doesn't, and which I can't even afford, it doesn't guarantee that I'll be able to upload more than 15 minutes. This is what they're doing. They, they could just flag one little thing in your video. They could flag like something of 30 seconds. You could even put maybe a maybe a few seconds of, you know, 
like Bugs Bunny going, uh-oh, you know, for something educational, and then they have you. Then they have you. This is why they want it on cloud systems, because now they they could just, you know, or, or, or you could be interviewing someone that has a license to a corporation, and so then if I interview someone, they could come after me claiming I'm violating copyright law. This is what they're doing. They want to shut me down. They're already targeting USWGO. If I do another documentary, I'm going to have to ask Change.Channel or another channel to do it because I, I, I can't upload more than 15 minutes now. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't upload more than 15 minutes. And they claim it's because my account is not in good standing. Can you believe that? Look at this not available for this account I mean this is what's happening this is what they're lovingly told me usually they don't have content ID in the standing system because it, it's just so flawed it's heavily flawed because a lot of good people that do obey copyright laws like me under fair use get tagged under content ID claims and I got literally over 10 uh, content ID claims, which I have to dispute, which means I have to go to court ten different times. I have to go to court. I have to go in front of a jury just so I can have the right to upload more than 15 minutes. I mean, this is YouTube now. It doesn't matter what I do. It doesn't matter. This is the end of USWGO's main channel. I may have to start uploading new channels. I mean, this is, this may be it for USWGO. This is tyranny. This has nothing to do with protecting people's copyrights. I mean, uh, under multiple... Under multiple claims, I mean disputes I have made, where I said I am protected under fair use. Uh, I'm a, I have a friend. He's a lawyer, David Kerr. He, 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 you know, he would say I'm under fair use. <laughs> he, I mean, he could say I'm under fair use. He could vouch for me. But it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if, if I get David Kerr to tell YouTube that I'm within fair use. It doesn't matter because everything is being run by this controlled system. That's what they're doing. They pass CISPA. They want to get rid of USWGF forever. This is what they're, I mean, first it's going to start with this. Then they're going to start you know, attacking me, saying, oh, they're using part of E1's material, even though Alex Jones says that he has the right to get the documentary out there. And they and E1 even told me in the email that I have every right to use excerpts in my documentary. I mean, this is what it's about. You know, they're going to use copyright as a means to shut you down. I mean, Content ID is the model. Ever since they started this, it's been a nightmare. And now, they've come after my account. They've come after my account. And there's going to be no stopping it.